Hello, my sexy muffins, and welcome back to another video. In this video, we are doing a resurrected and improved version of my Ethan Winters, female Ethan Winters reader slash listener series, which is going to be uh, first off with the scenario that was Lady Dimitrescu and ex Ethan female female Ethan reader Ethan Winters from Resident Evil 7 and 8 this is Resident Evil 8 village and we're going to do it the scenario is based off of what i have but also improved now on to disclaimers disclaimers Ethan Winters is not female in canon is not listener in canon this is just for fun and not to be taken seriously at all when you play the role as Ethan Winters it is the version that fits this narrative with yonderis and such and this is a one-off series of what basically they would react to you being a female Ethan Winters basically so yes I hope that you all enjoy this also, disclaimer, Lady Dimitrescu is not Yandere in canon. This is just for fun and not to be taken seriously at all. But she is a lesbian in canon. Fun that. But also, this is just for fun and not to be taken seriously at all. Sipping for fictional characters and shipping them is fine. As long as you are not illegal or gross about it, you remember to separate fiction, fiction from reality and head canon from canon. Yandere's are not ideal partners to have in real life. Oh, thank you. Now let's get on to business. Your name got into the castle relatively easy, but now it was time to find her daughter, which she had to do quickly. So she starts to walk into the main room, but suddenly there are bugs and these women, young women in their early 20s. And she, your name... She is pushed down by these women and then has a, a sickle stashed, slashed into her leg. And she is more or less dragged through the castle, up and down stairs, across the halls, and brought to a room where there is that big giant woman that had been fighting over her in the room, drinking some liquid. Your name looks at her bitterly and tries her best to get up, but the Women, the young women, step onto her hands to keep her in place. Mother, we have brought you fresh food, one of the young women say. And your, your name looks at Dimitrescu as she stands up. And she goes, my, my, your name, Winters. It's a pleasure to see you again. No wonder you were... Uh, such a charming little young woman able to get out of my idiot brother's traps she says you glare at her hatefully not wanting to speak a word to her <sighs> it's, it's going to be fun breaking you in but girls bring him up bring bring her up sorry i'm still thinking of ethan winters and say your name winters apologies B bring her up and suddenly you were dragged from your hands that were being stepped on and had them stabbed through your hand and you were lifted up onto the hooks. You groan at the feeling as you are shackled into the air and are dangling. Your feet touch, barely touching the ground. Well, not touching the ground, honestly. You were now so high up that you were over towering over Lady Dimitrescu, which was a very mighty feat. She grabs your hand from the hook, pulling it down and slashing it with her nail. It is sharp and painful. And she then starts to lick up your blood. You wince as her tongue touched your skin and she devoured it. Mm, going a bit stale, she says and throws your hand back onto the hook. But we will make do. Oh, what? what how will we eat her first, mother? One of the girl, one, young, one of the young women say, "Oh, we are not going to eat her. I'm going to turn her." What did she mean by turn her? The girls, the I'm just gonna say girls because it's easier for my brain. The girls look at her confused. What do you mean, mother? They ask. Uh, well, I'm going to turn her into something more so that she can be my wife and yours, 
your girl's other mother's mother, she says. They look excited, but also curious. And then they look at you again and back to their mother. Like hell I am, you say, spitefully spitting at her. And she grabs you by the throat, squeezing tightly. Don't you dare, little miss, she says. You will be their mother and you will be my wife. Mark my words. I don't care what I have to do. I don't care if I have to move heaven and hell for it. It will be done, she says, and then lets you go and you gasp for air. She then tells the girls to come and they walk out, waving you goodbye and you were left to hang there. You had to get out quick and you had to find Rose. Anyways, I know it was a little bit shorter than usual. I apologize. It was just a short scenario. This is a one-off. It's not going to be a mini-series. It's basically how the uh, series... It's going to be a mini-series, but not a continuous mini-series. It would be a mini-series, basically, how the they would all react to you as Yandere, as you are female Ethan Winters. So, anyways, I hope that you all enjoyed this. And if you would like to see more, comment what you would like to see, and I will do my best to do it. I currently, at the time of this recording, do not have my patrons because one was eaten off and one is other having other issues, and that is fine, so no Patreon outro today. Anyways, I hope that you all enjoyed this, and if you would like to see more, comment, subscribe, do all that good jazz, and I will do my best to have it the, done. This is going to be the second video of today. The first video is already recorded at this time and processed and ready to be posted. will be posted way before this because I have to edit this one. So yes. Anyways, I hope that you all enjoyed and stay sexy on my sexy muffins. Bye-bye. Secret outro time. Secret outro time. Secret outro time. Secret outro time. Secret outro of a baseball bat. Welcome to the secret outro, and the secret outro question of the day is, if you were in this situation as playing in the role of Ethan Winters, and you were in this situation, would you become the wife or husband or spouse of Lady Demetresk? Comment below what you would like to do, and yes, that is that. Anyways, I hope you all enjoyed, and stay sexy on my sexy muffins. Bye-bye.